Now, this is a great time for a flashback. Salome, the mother of the sons of Zebedee, is present at the cross. So we know she was a devoted servant. But she's more famous for her request in chapter 20. Then the mother of the sons of Zebedee came up to him with her sons, and kneeling before him, she asked him for something. And he said to her, What do you want? She said to him, Say that these two sons of mine are to sit, one at your right hand and one at your left, in your kingdom. Jesus answered, You do not know what you are asking. Are you able to drink the cup that I am to drink? They said to him, We are able. He said to them, You will drink my cup, but to sit at my right hand and at my left is not mine to grant, but is for those for whom it has been prepared by my Father. And when the ten heard it, they were indignant at the two brothers. But Jesus called them to him and said, You know that the rulers of the Gentiles lord it over them, and their great ones exercise authority over them. It shall not be so among you. But whoever would be great among you must be your servant. And whoever will be first among you must be your slave. Even as the Son of Man came not to be served, but to serve and to give his life as a ransom for many. I'm wondering if this conversation came into the minds of Salome and John as they witnessed Christ's death at this scene to be at his right hand and his left meant to be crucified as a common criminal.